What did I pick up then? I don't know what you picked up. Did I pick up anything? It was something. I don't know what's in there. Or whatever, just drop that in there. Toss the um, plant food in there. Oh, whoops, accidentally. on the ground. What? Disposal of dead bodies. Incineration. Destruction of the head. Okay. Oh god, that's what's all up with that. We have the flask and the lighter to burn bodies. Copying evil within much here, aren't you? Shut up. Can you be original Capcom? You're stupid. <laughs> I know. Where's the lighter? The lighter? Oh my god, is this far back? That was what the other item was, the lighter. We hadn't saved. Since I, I went into that room and got the lighter. That's why our fucking thing is down to two. I knew we had like eight ink ribbons. That's why I was confused. I thought you said you had saved before you handed it over to me. Mm -hmm. Oh, great. Okay, so... But wait, this got us back to the, the original. And I said you're making progress now. Great. Be ashamed of yourself. Cause I'm gonna go the wrong way in this room. I'm gonna go back into the dead end of the room that we can't get out of. And just die of starvation. Where the fuck? Okay. Yeah, look, cause there's no line through that yet, or through the other one yet. Yeah. So if I was gonna... Go... Well, I might as well try it to get the shoddy now. You can try it. Oh no, this door knob is now broken. Yeah. Yeah, so when you try it, then it tells you it's busted. Right, this is right around that time for you. And then it's it. That one is still. The door ain't got no knob. What? Well, go in. Oh, I don't even remember what we were doing back here. This is where I got the... I'm trying to get to the shotgun. No, now I'm trying to find the knickknack room. But all that lighter did was light the fireplace. And now it can light the bodies. Yeah, I guess we can. Here's knickknack room. Before I pick that up, I want to see what's going on. You know, now we can see what the fuck is going on with this. Oh, this is a dog whistle! What? What does it do? 
to say? He says, uh, today, so Spencer told me to hide something where no one could find it. I had this idea. I figured if I could somehow have it protected by a dangerous animal like the vicious canine that lives there, no one would be able to get near it. As far as I can tell, the mutt is always hanging around the second floor balcony on the west side of the terrace. And he also come running at the sound of the dog whistle. This is where you come in. The thing is, I reckon you're the only person that can get near that damn dog without risking a mauling. Which means only you can put this collar on him. The object that Sir Spencer wants hidden is concealed inside. If the only person I can trust with this, of course you'll get something out of it. Remember that certain item that you've always wanted to get hold of? Well, in exchange for your services, I just might be able to get it for you. This could work out well for both of us. Because that's not completely bizarre. So we've been ignoring that thing for a while now. That's the lighter. Yeah, fuck the shotgun. Let's go uh, try and uh, murder. Let's. I want to try and burn a body. I want you to do that because I want to hear if they put the line back in. What line? It's a famous line from this game. At that exact spot, you went the wrong way and died. Here is a dead body. Oh, I can't come by them. This would be useless. Let's uncombine this shit. There we go. What was over here? That is the scene room. I know. And why do I think it was over there? No, I meant what was down that other hallway on the second floor. Oh. It was um, a room you always can't catch. It makes me warm. Really? <laughs> Listen, the light makes you warm. I see. So, apparently... There is... So there's only eight saves. Yeah, and once you get to save eight, you then go and erase save one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if something fucks up, we don't lose all of our progress. Now I say you go in there and drop that dog whistle off, so you can get the shotgun. I don't want to go back into the shotgun then room. Then you give me the controller and I'll do the shotgun room. Fine. Because you're a fucking baby. Shotgun it then. You are a baby, you bastard. <laughs> I might just panic and do the same thing I did before. I'm not good in a clutch oh, situation, you're a Steve. Baby, my. Listen, I am not good in a clutch situation, Steve. Baby. Big, big baby. Whatever you Cry, baby. Cry, 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 baby. Cry, baby. Cry, baby. Cry, baby. Maybe we still have to set off that thing with the fire, because, like, I feel like we should still do it. Where was that? Oh, fuck if I remember. That's wrong. Found two typewriters. And we now know that there's a scary dog up on the second floor. Or if we go up on the second floor and we blow the whistle... A scary dog will come out. Out on the balcony. Oh, we have to get the key to go out into the balcony. Yeah. So, we're not near that. 
No, that's not something to deal with yet. It's a good time to sci-fi all. You're doing the big dog. Now I have to say, it would be nice to have the fucking map printed out or something. So I don't have to keep clicking it. I see what you're saying. Mm-hmm. Let me get scribble on it. To remember what door goes to what room. True. This might be a thing we need to do. It's absolutely a thing we need to do. We'll work on that for the next time. So just walk into that same room. You walk into the knickknack room? Yeah. Thinking it was the fireplace room. Woo for looping! Woo. Woo. All of the woo. <laughs> How woo you? I am so lost. I know exactly where I am. I don't. What did this one do? This needs an armor, right? Yeah, yeah, it needs an armor one. Well, I guess that's what we'll do. Next, after you have to have the shotgun. We'll go after the armor key. That mansion key that we that is in that trap we have to figure out. Yes, we need to figure that out too. There's a whole lot of things going. We got to We do got to figure that out. We can't figure it out. We'll get it. I don't know where the hell am I going. So let me get to that room. I don't know what that room is downstairs. Man, I really wish we would have gone for that shotgun right when uh, we first went in there. Now we do that key. We're printing out a map. Well, we will, but I mean, now we have to, like, backtrack something fucking awful. Yep. God damn camera. It's actually just like the evil within. Occasionally, her shadow scares me. <laughs> you don't see it. I'm like, is that a person? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you're almost there. You got it. Look at you. All better than me. That was the bathroom. This is death room here, right? Yeah. I was definitely right. It's called the death room, so now people can't yell at me. It is? Um, if you stand there, that's not the water death room that I found when I was a child, but it's definitely a death room. We won't do any ink living. Well, that's what that's from. I'm, I'm, I'm making the quote in the accent, but I couldn't remember what it was from. What? From Seinfeld. Oh. When whatever it was, whatever the cancer awareness or whatever it was, um, George wouldn't wear the pink ribbon. Or Jerry wouldn't wear Whoever it was wouldn't wear the pink ribbon. I think it was Kramer. And I was going, who wouldn't wear the pink ribbon? See, when you pick the shotgun up, it raises the thing. Right, that's what it is. <laughs> Look how she looks at her shoulder and goes, what? Maybe check the candles. I just want to see. 
do it oh, now. Oh shit. Squash. Wow, then what the fuck am I missing? Maybe like Cause that's the Jill sandwich room. Yeah. Barry's supposed to come and rescue you. Is he? Yeah. I'm pretty damn sure. Unless that's done on the Chris run. Oh god, look that up. I'm gonna. Okay. So, what we've learned in this situation, because Steve was acting like he knew all the answers. I thought we could get the Jill Sandwich. Apparently, Jill Sandwich line is not in this game anymore. No Jill Sandwich. Zero out of ten. <laughs> Gets a zero? Is that going to be your Metacritic score? Yep, zero out of ten. Alright, but apparently a thing I didn't realize, because I am a dumb, is that every single zombie in this game, if you don't burn it, can return as a crimson head. Yes, I'm going to go do that now. Um, we yeah. got two things of oil, so we're going to have to keep coming back for it. I recommend going for the newly, the newly killed ones last. Unless they're right there. They are right there. Go get them. Then. They are right there. They're right here. Go burn them. Burn them. Burn them fast or he's turning. Shut up. Move away, stupid! And there's another one. Did it do them both? Or maybe should I go over here? Go and do the other one. Yeah. Oh, it really uses the entire full canteen every time. It does? Ah. Uh, does, doesn't say one there? It now says only one left. It yeah, used to say it. two, didn't it? Yeah, see it. One for zombie. Back. I don't know, I use it. It must have gotten both of them since they were. Well, they were right on top of each other, so go back on top of them and use it. I can't search them? Why would you search them? Because sometimes there's shit on them. Or, I don't know. Try they, they... using the canteen again. Okay. Like right there or something. Move. This is gonna suck. Now we did kill that guy by stuffing a thing in his head and locked him back in that room. So if he turns into a crimson head, fuck him. What did he stuff in his head? Remember we stabbed him in the head? Oh, yeah. We should burn him, too. Because we have to take that path every time we go around that, that right side. No, no, no. That's the guy in the little room in the back. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay, so two is full, one is half, and then zero is empty. So you can technically do three? No, if you're in zero, you can't. Zero is empty. So two and one. It said, but when I went to refill just now, it said, whatever. I'm not quite, I'm really not questioning the fucking math in this game. Now how the fuck am I supposed to get around again? But yeah, I'm gonna get that one in the hallway. <laughs> 